What's up guys, Brian with Happy Thumbs Gaming here, and we are back with more of The Last of Us Part 2. This is Chapter 14, The Theater, All Collectibles. We're going to grab all the trading cards, weapon parts, artifacts, and supplements scattered throughout this level, but it is actually pretty quick. It's pretty cutscene intensive, and on that note, we want to remind you that we have removed all non-essential cutscenes. We have sped up the gameplay just ever so slightly, and of course, if you are in a hurry, we do have those quick links down below in the video description, but here we go. We have actually just removed ourselves from the tunnels and popped up on the street here, and right across the street, we noticed this theater we thought might be a good place to stay sneak into and catch a nightcap. So we break ourselves in, and as we do, it goes into this crazy cutscene that's like four to six minutes long. We went ahead and removed that for you so we could get right to the business. As soon as you get control of Ellie, go ahead and hop behind the counter and smash the glass on the far right. That's right, I said smash the glass. And we'll go ahead and pick up that trading card, which is really cheeky and kind of hiding inside there. Now jump over to the left-hand side of the counter here. We're going to find a couple of green boxes with a brown one on top. This is actually going to be right where the first artifact can be found. Now we're going to uh, plug our noses and quickly sneak into the old restroom here. And on the back corner, right above the dirtiest garbage can in the century, uh, we're going to go ahead and find a couple of, uh, well, you know, supplements. Now we're going to turn around and go right up the old stairway and upstairs around the corner to the hard left is going to be a nice little balcony. On this balcony, another hard left. There's going to be a little uh, table with a bunch of junk on it. We'll go ahead and swoop up the one thing that's needed, which happens to be artifact number two. Next up is actually turn around and all the way down the hallway, we got to take a hard right. I do feel like old Johnny was going to show up. It seems a little shining-ish back here. I was waiting for the twins, too. Not, not the twins, Basil, but like the twins, twins. In the back corner on the ground under some stuffs is the trading card. Make sure you swoop that up before turning around and doubling back and going into what is a room for employees only. And it turns out to be the way to the projection room of the theater. So we'll go up inside and take a left. And on the ground right next to the projector is going to be two piles of parts totaling four. And behind us on the desk is going to be an artifact sitting on the radio. Now, the story wants us to access that radio. And what it's going to do is indicate that we need some power and we got to find the way. So we'll go ahead and follow the old yellow power cable down and out the back window here. Which, as we hop out on the old ledge balcony, it's pouring. It's Seattle, right? It's going to be raining. And on the right-hand side, it's on the left as you pop out. It's going to be a ladder that goes all the way up the side of the brick building up to the roof. That's right. Raising the roof. Once we get up here, we're going to actually make our way all the way over to the right. Basically, follow the cable into the room. And on the ground is going to be a couple of weapon parts. Actually, it's one cluster of six. And uh, we're going to go ahead and activate this generator. That's right. you got to go ahead and pump, 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 pump it up. Hit those cues on time. Thank you. And look at that. We've got power. Now, you uh, might want to take a quick note at this guy here who uh, looks like he got a nice shocking... <laughs> Yikes. We'll go ahead and avoid that barbecue. All right, back down the ladder we go, and essentially what we're going to do is go all the way back into the projection room, and then all the way back down. Once we get back down, we're actually going to head over to the right side of the counter where we found that first trading card, and there's going to be a door that's locked. But because we mess with this radio right here, we actually rage out. Reese, Reese was you know, helping me out with this. He made a good point. He said, you know, this would have been like me. I would have been pissed and knocked the thing, too. And you guys always get mad at me for raging, but look at this. Rage actually led us to the next key that we needed to get into the door, which will allow us to advance the story. So uh, kind of funny how things work out sometimes. Like, you know, raging is not recommended, but sometimes it does a body good. Or in this case, it does our inventory good because we got some keys. All right, back down the stairs we go. As I mentioned, we're going to go to the right side of the little uh, the desk, the table, the whatever you want to call it. And we're going to go ahead and swoop open the door with the key. Thank you very much. All the way down on the far right side of the stage is going to be a handful of boxes. On one of those said boxes is going to be the fourth and final artifact. And that's actually going to wrap it up. I told you this was a quickie. Pretty easy. Mostly a cutscene. Like, this level is probably, you know, 20 minutes long, 15 minutes long. It's mostly a cutscene. So, swoop up that last collectible and then uh, don't get any stage fright. 
Yay, look at that, I'm shaking my head. Woo to the hoo, we're done. So are you. All right, that's gonna go ahead and wrap it up for The Last of Us Part Two, the theater, all collectibles. Hopefully you found this video helpful, and if you did, don't forget to smash that like button. And of course, if you felt it was extremely helpful, a comment's always nice to read. Uh, as for me, that's gonna do it. As always, until next time.